Jacksonville to Big Apple City has been so amazing. I don't want to forget a single minute. And thanks to this scrapbook, I won't have to. Hmm, now what should I include? I love the city. Golden Delicious Park, the Berry Works, Washington Apple Heights. The best part of my adventure? Definitely my new berry besties. Aw, Orange Blossom. She's been a great friend from the moment we met. And what an amazing business berry, right? Her citrus slice smoothie cart is, well, smooth. Okay, she can be competitive like me, which can get interesting. Need an extra boost of energy? All smoothies half off till noon. Buy one cupcake, get the second free. Sweet deal. Oh, it is on. Buy a small smoothie and I'll super smoothie size it free of charge. All the icing you can eat. Buy two, get ten free. Buy not, get them all free. <laughs> <laughs> of free spirit, so tapped into the creative vibes of the city. Her ice cream flavors at the Dreamery Creamery, delicious! And weird. Hey, what's the new flavor today? <gasps> How did you know? Now what? Exactly! Wait, what? You got it! I got what? Yep. I am so confused right now. The name of today's flavor is what? W-H-A-T, Wasabi Hazelnut Almond Toffee. Wow. Uh, no, wow is Watermelon Olive Walnut. That was yesterday. Lime Chiffon loves books and fashion. And books about fashion. She is really smart and nice. When she isn't running the Lemon Lime Time Cart with Lemon Meringue, she teaches me everything there is to know about Big Apple City. Hey, Lime, I was wondering about that building. That's the Cuban Time Museum of Modern Art. There's a Vincent Van Dill exhibit that you do not want to miss. I was actually... Oh, thinking of reading a book? The Macintosh Library has over 30 million books, including rare editions No, of... I want directions to Washington Apple Heights. Lime, no. I wondered if you wanted to split the strawberry banana bread. Oh, yes. Yes, I do. Huckleberry Pie? He's gonna get so many fans playing at the Berry Works. He's really nice, too. Even if he sees the world a little differently than every berry else. Mmm, what smells so good? Hot and fresh strawberry scones. Yummy, I'll take two. Great, that'll be... Allow me. A comb, two buttons, and a napkin. Oh, is that not enough? How do you think paying works? Uh... Woohoo! I'm rich! I'm sorry to be the one to tell you this, Huck, but... You need one more button to pay for these scones. Hmm, pricey, but worth it. <laughs> and then there's lemon meringue. Outgoing Barry, definitely more comfortable on her own inventing things for the Lemon Lime Time Cart. She's a little rough around the edges, but if you need something fixed, Lemon is your Barry. Right, tidy, uh, <laughs> fixed. Thanks, Lemon, you're the best. And not just fixed. I improved it. Improved it? What did you do? <laughs> Maybe I misjudged the pressure. Lemon. Hey, is that? Is that lemonade? I told you I improved it. Okay, this scrapbook is off to a great start. I know I'm gonna have so many more adventures in Big Apple City. And so many pages left to fill. You know what that means, Custard. More friends, more food. Sweetie Pie.
High Preschool's annual bake sale, baked and ready by five o'clock today. Sorry. Wow, you look terrible. You should really go rest. I can't. I need to get these cupcakes done. It's for the kids. <gasps> How about we help with the baking? Every berry needs some berries sometimes, shortcakes. I don't know if that's the best. Huh? <laughs> <sighs> oh. Okay, fine. Orange, you're gonna weigh out the dry ingredients here. Lemon, you stand here and combine the wet ingredients, and then we're gonna pass it to Blueberry. Wow, you really captured my aura. Uh, don't worry, we got this. Okay, okay, I'm gonna go rest in the clubhouse. Text me if you need anything. And don't forget, an extra large egg is better than a regular large egg. All right, girls, let's make our sweet, but very easily stressed out, friend proud. Let's yeah. do this. <gasps> it's like looking in a mirror. Blueberry, focus. Did you hear that? It said my name. Hmm. If I use the best methods from each book, I'll make perfect cupcakes. Butter must be super cold, got it? <gasps> huh, wait, this says room temperature butter is best. No recipes, no rules. Just me and Egg Sheeran. Riding. Five cups of sugar? That's unhealthy. How about no cups of sugar? <gasps> and maybe some powdered veggies to add some nutrients. <laughs> Yum. So healthy. Thanks, Custard, but I am not tired, so. You calm, keep you relaxed, keep you freaking out! What did you do? I'm calling it the unbearable icing of being. Ugh. I never made it past the butter. Oh no, I have to deliver 500 cupcakes of now, and nothing is done! Sorry, shortcakes. We tried, but we're just not the bakers you are. But how did this happen? You each did something totally different. You did whatever you wanted without any kind of... Wait a minute. That's it? You guys are geniuses. We are. Is she still hallucinating? <laughs> Looks like my build your own cupcake stand is a hit. And honestly, I never would have come up with the idea if you all hadn't messed up so badly. Thank you for being such terrible bakers and for helping when I needed it. Any time. <gasps> Lemon, no! <laughs> <laughs> I meant to do that. Thank you, Custard. You're not going outside, are you? I promised the gang a perfect outdoor picnic in Golden Delicious Park. Have you been outside? We're in the middle of a heat wave. It's hot, it's humid, it's horrible. <laughs> oh, please, <laughs> says who? In the middle of a heat wave. It's hot, it's humid, it's horrible. Come on, how hot can it really be? Bye-bye. <sighs> hey. Okay, yeah, it's a little toasty. <sighs> hey, everybody. Oh, where's our perfect picnic, huh? It didn't go great. No! Ah! There's no way we're having a fun picnic in this heat. I wouldn't say 
way, no way. You just need to bring your own outdoor air conditioning. It's hard being this cool. You wouldn't get it. Oh, we didn't invite you over. But the fan's not big enough for every berry. But your strawberry shortcake. You'll come up with some corny can-do solution. That's your thing. Oh. Whoa. Like we were saying, we're in this together. No berry left behind. Now would be a great time for one of those corny can-do solutions. Corny can-do solutions? <laughs> well, of course I have one of those. I hate to say it, it is too hot for a picnic. Aww. But the berries I've met, all the berries, have shown me anything is possible, as long as we do it together. When life throws me a problem and I don't have a clue Oh, I don't freak out, I don't get stressed Cause I know I got you And nothing's gonna get me down No problem is too great As long as you are by my side No problem we celebrate That's because you are mine, you are mine Oh, my very best friends forever Doing everything together Anything is possible entire family, Strawberry? Well, I want every berry there. Me familia es tu familia. Maybe. There's not enough space. There's not enough time. There's not enough food. It's impossible. Did you just say impossible? Yes. There is no way we can do this. I'll just, I'll text them. I'll tell them I made a mistake and ruined every berries, you know. Impossible is what the women in our family are all about. Impossible's my jam! We've got our work cut out for us. When things go wrong, then we adjust. If it's tough, don't get stressed. That's when we're at our best. And if your world feels like it's crashing down, we'll turn it back around.
amazing, fabulous, shockingly efficient. Yeah, we really are. Not to mention lucky. <laughs> saying? Carefully tended to, it can run over anything in its path. I can take care of that easy peasy. With what? Clippers? Uh, something like that. <laughs> the Incinerate 5000. I'll go get it. Have you seen Lemon use that thing? Wait up, Lemon! Let me help you! <laughs> Yeah, I don't see this ending well. There are less destructive ways to take care of an overgrown plant. Clint would never forgive himself if anything happened to his friends. Clint? Who's Clint? The mint! You know I speak plant. I think I speak for all plants when I say plants can't speak. According to Farmer Fig's latest guide to gardening, the first thing we need to do is trim the vines. Wait! You can't cut his lines now! Clint's playing rock, paper, scissors! Great move! Another W for the Clintster! <laughs> yes, Gerald, I know a piece of paper wouldn't beat a rock in real life. This guy. Farmer Fig says spraying a solution of salt, soap, and vinegar will tame unwanted plant growth. Clint, old chum, I'm here for you. Tell this berry what we should do. Whoa, you're trying to make says I should go on tour. Ah, oh, what a charmer. We'll never get this done if Blueberry shoots down every idea. Then maybe ask her what she thinks. She thinks she speaks plant. We don't always need to agree with our friends. Just listen to them. Clint, don't worry. I'm thinking about something. I'm... Blueberry, what do you think we should do? It's not about me. Let's ask Clint. Just so you know, Farmer Fig says that if we dig the mint roots up, we can... Move it into, into his, his own pot! pot. <gasps> Did you just agree with Farmer Fig? No. Clint agreed with Farmer Fig. He also said he'd be most comfortable if you did the digging line. He trusts you. You're really smart. I still don't believe that plants can talk. But it was nice of you to say it was smart. Thank you, Clint. <gasps> Aww. And done. Here you go. Thanks, Thanks strawberry. strawberry. <laughs> All right, it's incinerate time! <laughs> Actually, blueberry and lime work together to take care of the mint. But I saved you some pie. Let's do it! what it is, but it sounds cool, and I am going to win. Let's it up! 
Every berry touches the golden berry. If you break contact for any reason, you're out. Whoever is left touching it at the end wins the secret prize hidden inside. <laughs> inside of this anyway. Oh, an endless supply of books. <laughs> I'm gonna need more bookmarks. Books? No way. It's a Spicer CX Kimisaki Dirt Bike. Sorry, there is no way a kiwisaki fits inside that berry. No one does, though. Spark berries. Enough spark berries to fuel my greatest invention, the machine machine. A machine that makes smaller machines. <laughs> What do the smaller machines do? I will get back to you on that. I bet the prize is a perfect song. So, there's like a speaker inside. No, just a song. It will play once, then disappear. Forever. That's an interesting theory. What do you think, Strawberry? <gasps> Loves my authentic down home baking. I heard about, I heard about it is so nice. Ooh, look at me! I'm a simple country fairy! I make simple pastries for simple people! And I dress too matchy matchy. What? She does. I don't care how she dresses! She is taking all my customers! We need to show this country pumpkin how things work in Big Apple City. We're your neighbors. I'm Raspberry Tart. That's my truck over there. Oh, and uh, this is Sour Grapes. That's your truck? Oh, and cum drops. So pristine. Wow. It is nothing compared to this thing you've got going on. You're the fresh new fairy on the block. Oh, thank you. So, what can I get you, new food truck friend? Strawberry pie? <gasps> Strawberry strudel? Pano Strawberry. That's a new one. We'll take everything you've got left. Everything? Eee! Ooh, I, 
trust me? Do I have a choice? Huh? What is all this? You'll see. Working out is not your thing, but fitness is important. And since your thing is baking, we're gonna get you stronger doing what you do best. Go! Another! Again! Push it! You got it! I can remember. Why be worried when I know the universe is always watching? Let me get this straight. Your freezer is broken, your ice cream is melting, but you aren't gonna do anything because the universe? Oh, I'm gonna do something all right. Oh, okay. <laughs> Good. Hi, universe, it's Blueberry. My freezer is having a bit of a day. I was wondering if it wasn't too much trouble, could you send guidance? be friends with the universe. But luckily, I do have a friend who can help. Sunberry got a broken freezer. Oh, that was fast. I knew I could count on my buddy, my pal, my universe. Ice Cube Bot projects waves of cold air wherever he goes. Aww. as long as he doesn't get too hot. Okay, time for plan B. Uh, we'll be okay, right, universe? The fan to C-800 attaches to the side of your freezer and blasts the coolest air. It's a little draw. <laughs> Universe, any time now. The Mecha Sparkberry Turbo Cooler will freeze everything in the Berry Work, including your freezer! Oh, Lemon, quick question. Should the freezing machine be heating up? I'm gonna go in. No. My ice cream is melted? Oh, universe! Oh, we aren't the friends I thought we were. Blueberry, we're really sorry. Don't be sorry, friends. It's not you who let me down. It's the universe who made ice cream soup. Uh, ice cream soup? Oh. Ooh. Oh, silly me. The universe was right as usual. Uh, wait, wait, wait. What? The universe wanted.
wanted your ice cream to melt? <laughs> I know! That universe so wise. Strawberry, can you make me some waffle bowls? The universe is just like any friend. Sometimes they see things differently than you. That's when you have to really listen and trust that they're looking out for you. Who wants to beat the heat with a delicious bowl of ice cream soup? Oh, <laughs> yeah! Thanks, friend. Uh, can't argue with the universe. This soup is good. Delicious. Yeah. Business at the Extraordinary Berry is booming. Which is fantastic. Just one teeny tiny problem. Oh, my teeny tiny oven. I can't bake fast enough to keep every berry happy, which is a good problem. But still, it is a problem. My cranberry jam says every problem has a solution. I don't know anything about fixing ovens, but I know some berry who does. So, Lemon, what do you think? You came to the right berry. I'll give you an oven like no berry has ever seen before. Uh, nothing crazy. A little bigger. Maybe a second oven rack? Yeah, yeah, sure. Oven rack. Got it. Okay, let me know if you need any. And you're gone. I'm gonna turn that oven into a baking feast.
what's wrong with a little music? It's a lot of music everywhere. I can't escape it. Just stay by your... You don't have a cart. Nope. I go where the song takes me. <laughs> Thing is, all Berry Works vendors need carts. No cart? No you. <sighs> no sad strumming without a cart! <sighs> Bread pudding is correct. Every Berry Working needs a cart. <gasps> That's it! Huck can just work out one of our carts! It's a total win-win. Huck gets to stay, we get the help. Three blue blasts, two green meanies, one orange deluxe. Got that, Huck? Uh... Let's see how you do taking orders. I need a large lemon lime barricade blaster. Extra syrup, half ice. You need a small? Large. Extra syrup, half syrup. Half a berry. Half ice. Uh, got it. Right, right. Uh, blast the syrup. No! <laughs> uh, Maybe help lemon instead? French. Uh, no, no, no. Where did the chicken come from? Oh. Inspire us with creative new flavors. Oh, close your eyes. What do you see? I see vanilla. Uh, anything else? Vanilla ice cream. Maybe something more daring? Vanilla ice cream in a cone. Mind blown. Your energy is simple. You should share it with the world. Just not here. Okay, let's see how you do baking orders. The oven gets hot quickly. So... Make sure you use oven mitts. And... I think the mitts are... Huh? What is happening? Nothing. It's good that music's my passion. I'm no good at anything else. I'm really, really sorry, Huck. No tears, my song will never end Because I have you, my awesome friends Who love my art, with or without a cart <gasps> That's it! Instead of Huck working in our carts, we needed to help him get one of his own. The Huckleberry Pie Karaoke Cart! You all did this for me? Wow. Still here. I told you. No cart. No way. And there is nothing that can change. Look, Red. The girls made me my very own karaoke music cart. Karaoke? Very, very so contrary. Shake it up, pick it up, give me if I make it up. Get out of town. 
Red Hot would never steal from a baker as sweet and generous as Strawberry. Aww. Thank you, Huck. Besides, he's been with me all day. Uh, hey, let us help. Leave no bag of flour unturned, no critter unquestioned, no pie left behind. the last bite. I don't deserve it. Oh, thank you. <laughs> hey, it's okay, Lime. You tried your best. I'll just have to keep a closer eye on... Huckleberry Pie did it. <gasps> I would never. You ate my donut like an animal. Just like the pies. Why would I steal from Strawberry? She gives me pies for free. Um, say what now? Her sign said, hot pies only eat when cool. Strawberry likes my music. She thinks I'm cool. So she leaves those pies out for me. That's not what the sign means, is it? No not even a way. little. Wow. I stole the pies, didn't I? Uh, yeah, totally. Just wow. Oh, I'm sorry, Strawberry. I really did think those were thank you pies for my smooth and jazzy tunes. I do think you're cool, and your tunes are very smooth and jazzy. <laughs> Just check with me next time. There's still one mystery left. Why do you eat pies like that? Big Apple Fair's pie eating champion, three years in a row. No better way to enjoy a pie. Okay, Barry, on your mark. Get set. Another mystery? So It's fitting we're here at the Cuban Time Museum of Modern Art. Let's see how our bakers did. I love Fight of the City. Kiki Key Lime goes all over Big Apple City finding the best bakers. Could there be a more perfect show for me? As these cupcakes show, today's contestants proved a great baker needs to be a great artist as well. Yes, exactly. <laughs> Oh, get me, Kiki. Do you have what it takes to be the very best at baking? Oh, I do. Then I can't wait to come to your neighborhood and take a bite of the city. <sighs> Hello? Is there a baker in there? Yes, Kiki Key Lime. There really is. Behind you, actually. <gasps> I'm just imagine this and you're there. And it's just you're my favorite person. And I love you lots. I get that a lot. Hi, I'm in a rush to my next shoot, but I do need a quick bite. What have you got? Okay, okay, I can do this. I can totally do this. Don't freak out. Just take a deep breath. <gasps> Today, I am serving Lady Fingers. My cranberry jam taught me how to... Oh, I love Lady Fingers, but I'm wondering if you could add some organic hand-pressed key lime juice. And you know what I love? A hint of Costa Rican coffee where the beans have been sung to. They just have that extra oomph, you know? Also, could you throw on just a dollop of mascarpone cheese? If you can't, it's totally fine. But if you can, that would be more fine. Just need to grab some ingredients. It should take me. I have two minutes and 36 seconds. Custard, you're in charge. Orange, tell me you have key limes, please. Nope, just regular limes today. Can you juice it for me? Sure thing. Can juice it, please? Okay. Mm You're the best, I owe you a cake! Sometimes it's easier not to ask. Lemon, lime! Do you have Costa Rican beans that have been sung to? Why would I sing to coffee beans? There's no time for crazy questions! Seriously, who sings to beans? Everybody knows you read to them. It was the best of beans. It was the worst of beans. No time! Lemon beans! Hot music! The best things in life. That'll do it! I owe you all five! That was weird, right?
right? <laughs> no need. The universe has spoken. Mascarpone ice cream awaits. But how did you... Shh. You must go. I owe you some cookies. <laughs> Constructed tiramisu, delicious. That hit the spot. Extraordinary berry, huh? I'll remember that. Bye. Did you hear that, Custard? She'll remember that we did it. Now we can just relax and bask in the glow of this fantastic moment. Ahem. <laughs> Aren't you? Getting something. Pies. That something is pies. Right after we bake those thank you desserts. <laughs> <laughs> Business at the Extraordinary Berry is booming, which is fantastic. Just one teeny tiny problem. Oh, my teeny tiny oven. I can't bake fast enough to keep every berry happy, which is a good problem. But still, it is a problem. My cranberry jam says every problem has a solution. I don't know anything about fixing ovens, but I know some berry who does. So Lemon, what do you think? You came to the right berry. I'll give you an oven like no berry has ever seen before. Uh, nothing crazy. A little bigger. Maybe a second oven rack? Yeah, yeah. Sure. Oven rack. Got it. Okay. Let me know if you need any. And you're gone. I'm gonna turn that oven into a baking feast. Thank you, Lemon. Uh, in a battle, I am never going 
gonna blend batter with this old mixer. Mixer, huh? I can take a look. What mixer? Oh, what? Did you say mixer? I don't know what you're talking about. I'm just gonna stir this the old-fashioned way. Yeah, no more inventions needed here. <laughs> oh, none. No berry. And ice cream sculpture of me. And puppies parachuting in from the sky. Oh, and Kiki Key Lime has to be there. And that's what I want for my raspberry. Got it. Uh, Sounds totally. great. Thanks, berries. I was worried this year's celebration wouldn't meet my usual expectations, but with friends like you, I just know it's going to be the best birthday ever. <laughs> Did you write down what she said? What is that a doodle of you and Raspberry wearing crowns and sashes while I'm all alone over there? So we're going to delve deeper into that later. But for now, what are we going to do for her birthday? Cupcake candle card. Can't argue with the classics. Mm. Mom, Dad, I know you were worried since you won't be here for my birthday, but my friends are taking care of everything. It's going to be fantastic. This is raspberry. Raspberry tart. Call me when you get this. Bye. What? Birthdays are special. I wouldn't wish a bad birthday on my worst enemy. And, and well, that's raspberry. Wait, you want to throw raspberry tart, the best birthday party ever. Yes, raspberry wouldn't do that for you. She wouldn't do that for any berry. Sure, raspberry and I aren't exactly friends, but every berry deserves to have the best birthday. Who doesn't love a birthday? You get the cake. The weird blowy things that make noise! You won't stop speeching until we do this, will you? I will not! Okay. Let's throw a party! You're excited. I am! I have to be honest, I know it was a lot, and I wasn't sure you two would really do all the things I asked for. <laughs> when you say all the things... <gasps> everything I dreamed of! Right, but like, we may have missed one or two, or... All? No! It's perfect! Huh? <laughs> Uh, well, but I... We... Right? They kept telling every berry at the Berry Works how important this birthday was for you. They just wanted you to have the best day ever. We did say that! Only the best for you? <sighs> Red and Sour had nothing to do with this party. Why are you letting them take the credit? Because it'll make Raspberry feel good. Just like it makes me feel good that my friends were willing to help me plan this party even if they didn't want to. It's a good feeling when you know there are berries who will always be there for you, no matter what. Hmm. A luxurious lime! <laughs> Get rid of that basic bev and try this. The elderflower lemon icy from Peels of Plenty. The best drink cart in Big Apple City. Welcome. Uh, what was that about? Red Pudding's been acting really weird all week. Try these hair ties. They're less black than yours. Welcome. Mm -hmm. Here. The history of doorstops? Yeah. Books are your thing. Welcome. You have to up your frame game. Red, my glasses have a really strong prescription. <laughs> Welcome. I think he's trying.
trying to be nice. That's even scarier. I'm getting to the bottom of this. Mm -hmm. Bread, <gasps> you're being nice to lie in a weird, snooty way. What? What do you mean? Look, I know you and the other mean berries don't like me. Mean berries? Seriously? Look, I'm a big Lime Chiffin. She's the only other berry around here with any style. Obviously, since her dad is Fluffy Chiffon, the biggest designer in Big Apple City. You knew that, right? Sure I knew that. Yeah. I did not know that. Well, he just released the Fluffy Chiffon All-Season Multi-Weather Limited Edition Waistcoat. I have the best connections in the city, but I still can't get one. No. Uh. No. Hmm? Yes. <gasps> no. Oh. So, you're using a sweet, smart berry like Lime to get some vest? No. I did some nice stuff for Lime, a berry I could be friends with, so she would be nice and get me a waist coat. You gave her a lemon icy from some other card, a book she won't read, glasses she can't wear, and you insulted her hair ties. Have you seen her hair ties? Maybe Lime would help you if you were just honest. Right! Honestly, tell some berry who barely knows me that I want a waistcoat her dad designed? Why would she help me? Because that's how friendships work. If you really think you'd like to be friends with Lime, then try being her friend. Trust me, because I am really good at friendship. Uh, hi, Lime. So, what Bev would you recommend? Sure you don't want to drink from Peels O' Plenty? Sorry about that. And about the book? Thank you. Listen... Not done. If you like the glasses, I can get your crazy prescription put in, no problem. Oh, that's very... Still not done. Your hair is fab, and the new hair ties would show it off more. But yours aren't blech. Oh, wow. I... Almost there. I did all that so you'd help me get your dad's new waistcoat. But I'm also a big Lime Chiffin. You're just so you. Then why are you always so you? I wasn't always a trendsetter. I used to be shy and a tad klutzy. And sometimes it's easier to make fun of other berries before they make fun of you. But some berry said I should try being honest. So, I don't care about the waistcoat, but I would like to get to know you better. Behind you. <laughs> my goodness, are you okay? You're, you're... Bread pudding, this is my dad. Dad, bread pudding. Oh, then this is yours. Oh, I'm gumdrops. Uh, why? I may have overheard your chat with Strawberry. I'd like to get to know you better too. It's kind of funny when you're not being snooty. But right now, you have a waistcoat to try on. <laughs> Sweetheart, it's on backwards. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> See, Custard, I told you I was good at friendship. Is it spaghetti? It's okay, Strawberry. Every berry needs to know how to get around the city on the funnel system. Luckily, you have me to teach you. It can be very complicated, so do exactly what I do and memorize everything I say. We'll start here at Rhubarb Station and take the Pineapple Express to... <gasps> Yo. Shortcake. Can you and your pet rat help me? Ferret, actually. He's Red Hot, and I'm Huckleberry Pie. We play here in the funnel system for all our fans. We can probably take a break. Thank you. I have no idea how the funnel system works. <sighs> Figuring it out is easy. You just have to do it. But I don't know what I'm doing. What if I mess up? Just try a little something new. And I promise when you do, won't be as scary as you thought, and you'll be fine and make it through. I feel a little overwhelmed and filled with fear. Oh, you'll be fine. Not sure what I should do, it's all unclear. Just take your time. Well, what if I choose wrong and mess up this new song? Well, then we'll start.
Cake is my passion. <gasps> like baking for me. Baking? Well, eating is my second passion. Strawberry! Lime? Oh. I found you. Did this rat hurt you? Ferret, actually. And I'm fine. Huckleberry Pie helped me. He's a musician. Actually, Huck, why don't you come with us to the Berry Works? I'm sure every berry would love your music. Uh, sorry, Strawberry. I just can't disappoint my fans down here. Right. Well, at least let me give you a thank you, Cupcake. See ya! Mm. Mm. On second thought, uh, maybe it's time for Red Hot and I to expand our musical horizons. There are more cupcakes at the Berry Works, right? <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>